Georgia is making a comeback in uh, sweet potato production. So, uh, like others, you know, Schumann Produce and Schumann Farms, we've uh, we're diversifying our product offering, and we're getting into sweet potatoes. We're utilizing our land base, our access to water. And again, just the infrastructure, the concrete and steel that we have in place for our sweet onions is a great fit for sweet potatoes. We've been in sweet potatoes now for about three years, and so we're, we're focused and concentrated on growing Georgia production. Not the best looking girl at the dance, not when you ride by in a truck. Uh, we grew up onion people, and you know, I love a beautiful onion patch. Uh, you know, we've got some great tools that we use in the onion patch to control weeds, and. And, and those tools are not available in the sweet potato in, uh, industry. So um, it's, uh, it's a learning curve there for us over the years uh, it was, as we delve into sweet potatoes. And, and of course there's some rotation restrictions with onion people again, so we don't want to put anything out that might affect our onion crop. Uh, so there's a few weeds here scattered here and there, and, and we have to get accustomed to looking at that. Also, you see some discoloration in the field right now. Uh, we've had some really heavy rains this summer in July, and uh, that's caused a little bit of leaching in our potassium levels. Uh, also, uh, uh, the, the potatoes are really sizing. We've gone from a vegetative state to a fruiting state, and with that being going on, you know, you're pulling the energy out of that top. We're done growing the leaf, we're now growing the potato itself. So uh, that's a good sign when you ride by on a hot summer afternoon and you see that field a little wilted. That's exactly the way it should look. You'll wear yourself out digging up potatoes, but it's not a truth teller. Uh, it's just a small sampling of, of what you may find. But, but when that plow hits the dirt, that's, it's, it's Christmas morning. You know, the truth comes out about whether you've been good or bad. So. <laughs> this uh, uh, particular variety probably represents about 80% of the, of the potatoes uh, grown in southeast uh, Georgia and North Carolina. It's a Covington variety. Covington and Beauregard are the two primary varieties. So here you got uh, your tubers coming off. Uh, four, five, six usually is what you have per plant. Uh, potatoes are a little bit squirrely about maturity. They could be anywhere between 80 and 120 days, depending on environmental conditions, fertility, and uh, heat units. Uh, so right now we're, uh, we're about 85 days. So from what I'm looking at, probably be ready around the middle of September. Potatoes go well with our, our curing rooms, our drying rooms. They go well with our, our storage rooms, our bins. Everything about handling that crop, with the exception of the grater itself, fits well with us. Uh, another thing I really like about the potato, you can grow it and store it and sell it 12 months out of the year. 